China is retaliating tonight for last night's decision by President Trump to increase tariffs on $200 billion worth of imports. But the president's commerce secretary says American consumers will not actually feel the effects and China is, quote, out of bullets. So is it? Correspondent Rich Edson reports from the State Department. A massive escalation in the trade fight between the United States and China. And President Trump warns his administration is preparing to hit even more Chinese imports. If there's a retaliation against our farmers and our industrial workers, our ranchers, if any of that goes on, we're going to kick in another 257 billion dollars. That would be on top of what China and the U.S. have already announced. This morning, China said it would raise tariffs on 60 billion dollars of American imports. Yesterday, the Trump administration announced it will increase tariffs on about 200 billion dollars of Chinese imports. The U.S. tariffs on Chinese goods target handbags, seafood, parking meters, luggage, and thousands of other items. China is raising tariffs on American food and industrial products. The U.S. Chamber of Commerce says, quote, there are less harmful ways to truly achieve free and fair trade with China. The administration did not heed the numerous warnings from American consumers and businesses about rising costs and lost jobs on Main Street, in factories and on farms and ranches across the country. The U.S. and China say they're willing to discuss their trade differences, though there's little indication of that happening soon. Going forward, we can't have a healthy global economy if one of the biggest economies is basically a predator. With a $375 billion trade deficit last year, the U.S. can still target hundreds of billions more in Chinese imports. After this latest round, China has already announced tariff increases on most U.S. imports into China. We are willing to make concerted efforts with the U.S. to this end. But regrettably, the current U.S. actions of unilateralism and protectionism are unacceptable to us. Commerce Secretary Wilbur Ross in an interview this morning on CNBC said that Americans won't really feel the increase in prices because of these tariffs because he says they'll be spread across thousands of products. Though these tariffs target consumer goods and companies are already warning they'll have to raise prices. Brett. Rich Edson live at the State Department. Rich, thanks.